talk today about rent to own or what we call a lease with the option to buy. And if you're a tenant out there looking to find a home to rent, um, a lot of times you're looking to see, well, I'd really like to rent this home, but I'd really like to buy down the road. So I'm going to try to find a landlord that's going to help me and agree to let me rent the home for a little while and then have that option to purchase the home down the road. And the option of purchasing it could be anywhere from, you know, one year, six months, two years, whatever. It's, a lot of it depends on your situation. Do you need money to, um, to, or time to get the money together for your down payment? Do you need to clean up your credit score? You know, what's your time frame? So think about that, what time frame you want to do with that. You want to make sure everything is in writing. And in California, we actually do a real estate purchase agreement. You do an option to buy form and you also do a lease agreement form. So you've got all three of those. You, you set a price with the landlord, the purchase price that, you, that you're going to purchase that home for down the road. You also set the term of the option. Is it gonna be six months? Is it gonna be a year? Is it gonna be two years? Whatever it's going to be, everything's negotiable. And then you go and you want to clearly understand exactly you know what this purchase agreement says what the option agreement says what your lease agreement says and you understand the terms and a couple things to think about is you're setting the price right now and let's just say it's a two-year option and in two years you decide okay i'm ready to buy this home but the value of the home has declined so you want to kind of think about what happens if that happens so uh, that's something to think about. The other thing is uh, your agreement with the landlord. If you're going to be doing any kind of improvements on that home, thinking that you're going to be purchasing it, are you going to get reimbursed for those improvements if for some reason you do not purchase the home? So kind of think about things like that. And please uh, hire a professional real estate agent to help you out on this. And good luck. <music>